אהלן שלום חברים, שלום חברות, אתם מצטרפים אלינו לסקודה מוטור ספורט אה, כאן אה, לא רחוק מ... מפראג, צ'כיה אנחנו כאן בביקור מאוד מעניין, אתם באים איתנו לעשות היכרות עם אחת המכוניות הספורטיביות הכי מוצלחות של קטגוריה R5, הפאביה R5 המכונית שאתם רואים כאן היא המכונית החדשה שלהם בעצם זה R5 איבו, זה הדור האחרון של המכונית הזו. סך הכל סקודה נמצאת עם המכונית הזאת ב-WRC2 וה-WRC2 פרו מצליחה לא מעט, הרבה מאוד מכוניות שלהם מסתובבות שם וזה בעצם הדור החדש. הרבה מאוד מהמכונית הזו מבוססת על מנגנונים שכבר קיימים בפאביה הרגילה, 30, אם אני טועה, 33 אחוז. כמובן שיש פה מיליון ואחת התאמות. כן, יש פה מיליון ואחת התאמות. יש כאן, בואו נעשה הצצה פנימה. ככה נראית מכונית ראלי. טהורה מבפנים. מהמכונית הספציפית הזו יוצרו רק 20 יחידות. זה האיבו, כן? זה הדור האחרון, מושבי בקט. יש לנו כאן... ידית ההילוכים, חמש מהירויות סינקוונציאלית, זה אומר שדוחפים ומורידים וזה מעביר הילוך, בלם יד, אומרים לוחצים כאן ואז במשיכה הוא נכנס לדריפטים בפניות, אה, מטורף הריח שיש כאן, ושימו לב עד כמה זה פאביה, יש לנו ארבעה מושבים, אבל כאן לא תמצאו מושבים, תמצאו גלגל ספייר, מכל דלק באזור התשעים, תשעים ליטר, תראו איך פותחים את הדלת, מטורף. שני גלגלי ספייר, אגב, גלגל לוקח לנהגים, שימו לב, לנהג ולנווט, דקה וחצי, פחות או יותר, להחליף. מהרגע שהם בתוך המכונית, מקבלים Q, תוך דקה וחצי, הם בתוך המכונית, מכניסים לראשון ויורים את עצמם קדימה. דקה וחצי, מה אתם עושים בדקה וחצי? זה מטורף. אגב, תיבת הילוכים, בערך 15 דקות, מנוע קומפלט חצי שעה. זה מטורף. הכל כאן נגיש, הכל כאן מדהים. ועכשיו... אני מצטרף ל... בועז ודייוויד! היי! הלו! לפני שאני מתחיל... שמעתי אותך אומר שתיבת הילוכים זה 15 דקות, נכון? 15 דקות. קבל תיקון, 13. 13, סורי, אני אומר 15 דקות, ואני אומר 13 דקות. 13 דקות. אוקיי, 2 דקות, זה רק לשתות את הקופי. אז מה שיש לנו כאן זה בעצם הדור הקודם של ה-R5, זה לא ה-Evo. זה לפני ה-Fastlift ולפני ה-Evo. נכון. תכף אנחנו ניכנס לפרטים, וזו הזדמנות נדירה עבורכם וגם עבורנו לראות מכונית שהיא מקולפת לגמרי. זו מכונית ממש, זה מנוע אמיתי, מתלים אמיתיים, הכל כאן אמיתי כמעט, ואפשר לראות את זה לעומק, ואנחנו נעבור עם דיוויד כאן, שיסביר לנו מה אנחנו רואים, איך המנגנונים האלה שאנחנו מדברים עליהם כל כך הרבה עובדים. באמת זה מסקרן, אז תפתחו את האוזניים. דייוויד, first of all, thank you so much for having us here. Yeah, no problem at all. It's amazing to see uh, this peeled car. Mm -hmm. And let, let's start talking about the engine. What do we see here? Just a, just a second. Oh, just a second. Yes. Let's speak about the specification, ah, specification. of the engine, okay? Mm -hmm. Just before. I just converted, אני אימרתי את הנתונים של ההספק שלה, כי מדברים פה בקילוואט. קילוואט. בצ'כיה מודדים את זה בקילוואט. נכון, נכון. במדינות אחרות באירופה. זה ההספק בכוח סוס. 275 כוחות סוס, על כמה? על טון... טון 230, זה המשקל של האוטו. זה יחס יפה מאוד. מומנט. 43 קגם, 43 קגם. 420 ניוטר מטר. 420 ניוטר מטר חלק ב-10 זה 42 קגם. מטורף לגמרי, מטורף לגמרי. צריכה דלק. מנוע 1600, צריכה דלק 60 ליטר ל-100 קילומטר. חסכונית היא לא. לא, היא לא. חסכונית היא לא. אז זו מכונית שהולכת על הקצה. בדיוק. אז זאת המכונית, לא דיברנו על צמיגים, על צמיגים, בלמים של ברמבו ומערכות אחרות, אבל בשביל זה יש לנו את... דייוויד, let's start talking about the engine, let's talk about, start to talk about the intercooler, let's talk about the turbo charge, how the system works. How the system works. Okay, okay. Please. I'll try it. Turbo charger works with the two loops of the air. Okay. One is fresh air, and one is, let's say, um... We will do some uh, simultaneous from, from the translation. So, yes. so uh, here is the inlet of the air, which is sucked here. In the okay, to the, the turbo. Paul Nishav Avir. Nisat Avir. Nisat Avir. And he's going to the turbo. It goes here to the turbocharger. And uh, this is 
very important part, uh -huh. which is called restrictor. Okay. This is uh, something which has a hole inside and it has a uh, diameter 32 millimeter. 32 millimeter. This is a cotter of the inside of the air. If it was more, if it was more, the spec would have gone up. Because it's a cotter. We want to cut it, the FIA and everything that we need. What else do we have here? The air is coming... To the turbocharger and yeah. turbocharger is turning and turning. This and one here is turning. Yeah, this is this is turbocharger yeah. and this is turning. The air is yeah. proper inside. Okay, and the then propeller. the okay. air goes very very fast under the big pressure through this hole. Okay, but because it went to uh, through turbocharger, it's very mm -hmm. hot. Now it's hot. The air here yeah, very, is hot. Very hot. Very hot. So yeah. it's going now to intercooler. To intercooler. Yes. Because it has to be cooled down because otherwise uh, the power will be not so high. Because, it's not efficient. Because engine likes to have uh, fresh air in uh, cool temperature. It's, it's like us. We like fresh air. Exactly. Yeah, fresh and cool. Okay. So and the air. Uh, the cool. so, so the air is coming. Air is coming. Air is coming. Air is And then yeah. from here. Yeah. It's cooled down. Yeah. And then it goes through throttle body. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, then it goes to inlet manifold of the engine. And this one got some very, very important part. Yeah. This uh, this part is called pop off. And uh, this How is do part you say it? pop off. Pop off. Oh, yeah. Because pop this off. is the part which makes psh, this mm, when it's charged too when much. When it's charged too much. When it's charged over two point five bar. Two okay. point over two point five. Over. Yeah. So so uh, it can do two point five, two point six. Boom. Yeah. The shakan nine and a half bar. Nine and a half bar. שתיים וחצי בר, אם זה הקדישה, אם הוא יותר, לא יודע מאיזה סיבה, פשוט הוא לא ייתן לו יותר, הוא פשוט יקפוץ. ואז הכוח יצנח. יצנח, בדיוק. אוקיי, אז זה 4 סילינדר? כן, זה 4 סילינדר, 1.6. הבלוק זה נורמל בלוק של סקודה פאביה. זה uh, בלוק מהאנג'ין uh, שעכשיו יוסט נשקודה אוקטאביה, אודי, פולקסווגן. The original engine, if you know, is standard, uh, st standard block. Yes, it's uh, completely standard block and completely standard cylinder head as well. Okay, guys, I know that we can actually talk a lot about just the engine. I want to go backwards mm -hmm. to the drive shaft. Yep. And let's talk about, so the power, a koach me gear mikan. This is the gear, the gearbox. Mm -hmm. And it's go back, 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 back. And yep. it's come to the rear differential. Exactly, and uh, thanks to this uh, rear differential, uh, we are able to have uh, Fabia with four-wheel drive. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. otherwise Fabia is only two-wheel drive, uh, and that's why we have this drive shaft here. There is no normal Fabia four-wheel drive. No, 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 no. That means uh, we had to modify the tunnel of the car and chassis, and so on to be able to have it like this. So this is one of the biggest differences between yes, yes. the R5 and the normal Fabia. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. exactly. So as the car comes to Cannes, in fact, עובר לדיפרנציאל הזה. ואתה מקבל גם הנאה אחורית. מקבלים הנאה אחורית, והדיפרנציאל, התפקיד שלו להעביר את הכוח בהתאם להמון המון פרמטרים, אם זה... לחלק את הכוח. אם זה היגוי, אם זה ההסתירה, אם זה ההסתירה, אם זה ההסתירה. It's control it and it can send the power to the right tire. Yes, when tire. you are turning, it, uh, the uh, number of revs of the wheels uh, are not the same. That means uh, it's the reason why there is a differential. Yes. כשהסיבוב של הגלגלים הוא לא זהה אחד לשני, mm -hmm. אז זה הדיפרנציאל בעצם, בשביל זה צריך את הדיפרנציאל. Mm -hmm. uh, about the shocks. In, the suspensions. In the, in the back and in the front. Mm -hmm. The same? Uh, Of course, I think it's not the same, but uh, the system inside is uh, the system, very I mean. similar. Let's it's yep. hydraulic or air? Uh, it's hydraulic. Hydraulic, and of it's course. McPherson. 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 Yeah. Can you explain us maybe how does it work? The suspension. Yeah, the tire is getting hit from the ground, and yes. then what's happening? Then, uh, then the. Uh, the spring. It's, the it's, spring. It's compressed. Oh. The spring is compressed. Yes. But uh, there is also. Um, Damping inside, it's damping, uh -huh, because uh -huh. when it would be only a spring, it would make <laughs> yeah, all the time. jumping. Yeah, it, yes. it would be like that all the time. And that's, that's why you need to control the speed of the wheel going back to the... So uh, this is the rebound, what they talk about the rebound? Exactly, this is rebound. Okay. And this is something uh, which... Uh, which uh, is which uh, which uh, So this, this you can uh, influence by uh, the density of the oil and uh, settings inside. Of the valves. Of the valves, of yeah. the oil yes, going yes, through. Yes, this yes. one, can, this one can be calibrated or not. Uh, yes, it could be. It, it could be, be calibrated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Of it of a of valving. You do different valving, and it's it's, uh, it's yeah, different. It's, it's, it's inside, and uh, you can uh, everything uh, dismount. And uh, this is the gas tank. 
oil tank. The oil tank, I'm sorry. The oil gas tank. Air. If it was a balloon of air, a balloon of air, a balloon of air, it would be air. That's right, it's a shaman. It's an expansion bottle and uh, it's there because uh, you need to cool the oil down. Okay, I see. Otherwise so it's boiling. Like it's uh, working. So we are, we explain in Hebrew for a second for our viewers. As much as we're betem that the machine is over it, me all this is a bumper or no matter what. Sela. At some point, ole at kfitz nitchas, and she yored it in chazara. The tafkid of the bolem can is to yored it in a way that is not covered. If there was no bolem in the front, it's like a she yored it. If there was no bolem, הקפיץ היה פשוט עולה ויורד, עולה ויורד. What are these for? You can... This is the setup, what does it do? You can turn with this nut and it makes a pretension of the spring. Like stiffer? Yes, pretension, כן. Pretension. דרגת המתיחות של הקפיץ. אתה יודע, אני מתעסק עם דרגת המתיחות של הקפיץ. So this was on one cent, I mean very shortly about suspension. How does it work? Can we go to the next system, the interesting, maybe the brakes? Brakes, system? of course. Could be, could be. Yes, yeah. brakes. So it's amazing to see it cut Rainbow. like that. It's a rainbow uh, setup, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Yep. So this is the disc, this right? This is the disc, yeah. This is the caliper, mm -hmm. and this is the pad, exactly. the brake pad. Exactly. Okay, in it. Can I, can yeah, I can? Yeah, yeah, you can. These are the refidot, friends. See, you left. You see the refidot in the lamp? What happens is that the gas is moving, and you see that they are here. וכשאני לוחץ עוד אחת מהצד השני, זה פשוט בולם את המכונית והרפידה נגמרת. נכון. ברגע שהבלמים שלכם נגמרים, שאומרים לכם נגמרים הבלמים, זה החלק הזה. זה או הרפידה או הדיסק או עצמו. הדיסק. לרוב, אם... הדיסק, אם... לרוב הדיסק הולך הרבה אחרי הרפידה. נכון. אם הגעת למצב שהדיסק ניזוק, כ... אז אתה במצב לא טוב. ואחד הסיפורים שאומרים הקפת קירור שאנחנו עושים, זה בשביל לתת לדיסקים להתקרר, כי כשהם חמים, השחיקה שלהם... עצומה. מועצת, נכון? דרך אגב, אם הגעת למצב שהדיסק שלך נשחק, לך לבדיקת אוזניים. בדיוק. צריך ללכת לרופא אוזניים. If you got into a situation where the disc is getting damaged, go and see the ear doctor, because you have a problem with your ears. What are these? This is the bearing. The bearing. This is the bearing. This is the bearing, which holds the wheel in the right position, but it has to be very stiff. Why you use Brembo? Why you have to use such a... It's expensive uh, system. It's uh, it's always uh, yeah for the in the ready. Uh, it's uh, very important to go fast and to be able to accelerate. But uh, even more important is uh, to be able to break. To break. Yeah. Okay. Can you tell us what does it call and what's the uh, job of? Yeah. This is this is uh, anti roll bar. Anti roll bar. And uh, this is uh, something uh, which is important for the stability of the car in the uh, when it's turning. Okay. So, uh, so it's limited the way that the 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 wheels can. Yes. Can yes, yes. okay. Because uh, you can imagine that uh, when here it's compressed, mm -hmm. on the other side it's uh, moving accordingly. Okay. And uh, you can uh, set uh, with the stiffness of this uh, of this uh, shaft, you can set the stiffness of this anti-roll bar, mm -hmm. and you can also set the geometry here, and mm -hmm. it makes uh, some small uh, differences. But our drivers are, are very sensitive to oh, this, uh, to these differences. And, and yeah. the purpose of all this is to keep the rear part of the car balanced. To keep all the back of the car balanced. מאוזן. אגב, לא רוקד, לא משתנה, exactly. לא זה. Yeah. And in off-road car, you mm -hmm. can disconnect that. Yes. Because you want a long, the longest uh, מהלך מתלה. Yes. The, the longest, longest uh, way of, of, mm -hmm. the, of the spring. You want it, you want it all the way. Yeah. To, to do a long traveling. But in, yeah. in, a, in a race car, you don't want it. You yeah. want to be balanced and it's one important that's, that's thing. Right. One, one maybe one important uh, thing uh, for the brakes, uh, for the ready car. Uh, one of the most important parts is uh, the handbrake. The handbrake. Mm -hmm. ah. Because when you to... Yeah, we saw it over there. Yeah, they use because... it often. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, if you use the handbrake in the uh, racing car, it makes an interesting thing. And this is that uh, it disconnects the function of the rear brakes. Because then you can make this power slide. That mm -hmm. You have a handbrake and you have a gas mm -hmm. and your car is really oversteering and you can go uh, very fast uh, through the corner. Yeah, so it's very important. Yeah. It's a part of the technique of the driving. Yes. What are we going to see? Can, we, can you explain a little bit? 
about the steering system. By mm -hmm. the way, this is, uh, this is the brake system. The complete, what we saw before, you can see. How big is the, the disc? Do you remember? Uh, uh, I, don't, I think three, three, 355. 355. Yeah. 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 It's not necessary to have such a big, mm -hmm. such a big brakes because uh, anyway on the gravel slower. you don't need. It's not only about slower, but uh, you don't need uh, so much uh, braking power because anyway uh, the surface uh, is not so abrasive, it's so rough, yes. it's not necessary. This one, uh, the tire is coming here just mm -hmm. to make uh, things very, uh, uh, and this is for cooling. Exactly, because uh, overheated uh, brakes doesn't break. It doesn't so. break. It so. just melt. Okay, so this is a rainbow. What else interesting? Oh, the steering yeah, system. Yeah, the steering system. Yeah, this is interesting that uh, the steering system uh, comes from uh, standard cars. Mm -hmm. the steering, also, steering column. Same materials, everything. Yeah, uh, just uh, just uh, some machining which is done here, but uh, but uh, otherwise uh, most of the parts are from standard production, and hmm. of course steering is uh, crucial for the ready car yeah. yes. because. Uh, Otherwise, you will not be able to make, uh, to steer. for example, Corsica <laughs> ready yeah. with uh, 10,000 curves. Mm -hmm. It's uh, like uh, fitness for your arms. Yeah, 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 yeah. And also we see the exhaust system. Yeah, exhaust system is, uh, is also interesting. We have these uh, parts here because uh, when it's uh, heated, everything is uh, Twist. twisted and lo uh, long. So it has to have some, uh, so some, uh, some, space. some, some space for the movement. Mm -hmm. I see. And this one is like for a... Uh, Flexibility. This one for a... Uh, this is Lambda. Sensor. Lambda sensor. Lambda sensor. Mm -hmm. Sensor, yes. Yeah. Okay. This is Lambda. This uh, measures uh, if the mixture of air and... Uh, and is not uh, good. You can actually... Fuel is, is right. And when it's, when it's not set right, it uh, sends signal to the engine mm -hmm. and uh, modifies the ratio. And, and the, ac the action is doing automatically or yes. the driver can change something as well? Uh, this is uh, made automatically, but we have different uh, maps, maps for the engine. Okay. Even in the rally, you got different maps? Uh, in the rally car? There is different car for the uh, gravel, for, mm. the, uh, for the tarmac. I see. And uh, for different fuels, of course, because this car can run with the uh, common fuel from the gas station, but also for the racing fuel, which yeah. has uh, 103 octants. I see. Do you want to show me something? Different kind of tarmax. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's snow or ice? How you call it? Uh, we call it, uh, yeah, for the snow. Snow. snow, but, snow. but it's always mixture. It's a mixture. Yes. 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 This is this is off road, right? Yeah, this is uh, this is for the gravel. Gravel. This is uh, this is for the gravel, and uh, this is for example Spanish ready, Portugal ready, mm -hmm. Germany, uh, Finland. Ge Germany is here. Germany is slick. This one Finland. This is, I, I this, is, this is not Finland because Finland ready is uh, normally in summer. Mm. But this is for Sweden ready. Sweden. 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 And uh, most of the maybe Finland Monte Carlo also. Monte Carlo as well. Yeah. Monte Carlo. Also. What is the, what is the most difficult to drive on ice, uh, mud? Or oh, it depends on the driver. Mm, depends Probably on the driver. depends where you grow. But on the yes. traffic jam, on the traffic jam. On the traffic jam, it's, 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 it's the most it's disaster. Difficult, yeah, yeah, it's yeah, the yeah. most yeah. difficult thing in life yeah. to drive in a traffic yeah. jam. No matter what tires you use. Doesn't matter the tires. <laughs> doesn't matter nothing. Okay. And also when you're late, it's so difficult. It's so difficult. Drive, so yes. we, I think we're mostly covered. Not all, but all of the big, big parts. Rock lagid, rock lagid, okay. Tank Delek. Tank Delek. 83 liters. I'm up to 90, more or less. 82. 82. Here we have to be very careful because actually right under the tank uh, we have a silencer. There is isolating stuff between the two of them? Yes. Which, is, which material uh, you use? These are uh, surfaces of laminate and, uh, and uh, sheet metal. And, uh, sheet metal? Yeah, yeah because, okay. because it's 80 kilos of the fuel, so it has to be very stiff as well. שמים שם בידודים של יריות מתחת. זה עם קבלר אגב, המון קבלר ו... 
And all these uh, parts here are uh, because of the, uh, the pressure? breathing. Because of the breathing. Of the, yes. Yeah, yeah. Nasham. 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 Mm -hmm. yes. Because otherwise so the you have fueling. Yeah. Otherwise the gas, the, yeah, yeah, the petrol yeah. will jump yes, on you. Yes, yes. Or it's uh, like it's FIA. Yes, it's yeah, FIA. Everything uh, is controlled. FIA control. This one. Yes. And, wow. Uh, Okay. It's flex. It's it's flexible. It's flexible. And, uh, it's full of uh, the special, let's say, foam. Foam. Yes. yes. For my, uh, well, in case of an accident, that it, it yeah. won't yeah, be yeah, yeah. breakable. Because of accident and uh, because uh, the fuel is not making. Yes. Mm. Okay. okay. It's a spia. If 50, 50, 50 liters just driving from side to side, yeah. it can affect the... Yes. The driver can feel it. can feel it. Oh, absolutely. Wow, it's very good. Something else, David, or we pray pretty much... Well, maybe just uh, yeah. that uh, the cooling is... Uh, yeah, we love to steer about The cooling that. is uh, very, very important for the brakes as well. That's why we have these channels here. Ah, this is the... Okay, it's for Kones, and it goes all the way to the disc. Exactly, exactly. And you have to be very careful during the winter rallies because mm -hmm. then these channels could be stuck with the snow. Ah, snow so or it's... Mud. Then, or mud. Or mud. mud. And then Can the you do something about that? I mean, you're driving. I mean, you cannot avoid... Uh, this is something which is uh, mainly on the drivers, that they should be able to clean it after every spe special stage. They should not... Uh, Make sure it's clean. Uh, ...forgot. Yeah. I see. Uh, okay, guys, thank you so much, David. Okay. It was short but That's very better. lightning for our viewers. Our life will be different. Different. Uh, after, after today, yeah. yes. Thank you very much. So, have a good זה פחות או יותר, או לא פחות או יותר, זה בדיוק איך נראית סקודה פאביה R5 מבפנים, הקרביים, ראיתם איך נראה המנוע, ראיתם איך נראים הברקסים, אופן הפעולה של חלק מהדברים, כל מערכת כזאת אפשר לדבר עליה בנפרד במשך שעות, כי יש המון חשיבה לכל וכל פרט, אבל ניסינו ככה בוולוג הזה להסביר לכם לפחות על קצה המזלג את אופן הפעולה, אז אני מקווה שנהניתם, שתפו, סאבסקרייב פעמון קטן ותוכלו לראות את כל הדברים שאני מעלה כאן בהמשך אנחנו הולכים לעבוד אנחנו נתראה בפעם הבאה להתראות